I've never been a part of something so anticipated. And I am deeply curious about why, like why are people so excited about this? So it seems like Ugly Betty Barbie has picked this really big gay fan base who really are devoted to the film and that's before it's even come out. What do you think it is about the film Barbie that attracts that audience? I don't know. I mean, I, I think that um, the movie exudes like a fun and a brightness and, and, and a permission to just express that I think is enticing to so many people. I've never been a part of something so anticipated and I am deeply curious about why, like why are people so excited about this? I, they, they haven't even seen the movie. Um, I'm excited for people to see the movie because it's an incredible time and my hope is that people are surprised about what it actually is. but. Um, the excitement has been a little bit of like a, a mystery. And as someone who is so beloved by the gay community and the LGBTQ community at large, how does it feel to have work like Barbie and Ugly Betty so beloved by the community? I mean, it's it's wonderful. It's so special, you know, to get to meet people all the time who share growing up watching Ugly Betty, you know, was like a, a comfort to them or it gave them confidence or it, you know, it encouraged them. It's, it's so beautiful to get to be a part of telling stories and making um, entertainment that, that helps people feel braver in their own lives. Uh, you've described your character in Barbie Gloria as being low on a totem pole at work and wanting to climb the ladder. Did that remind you at all when you got the role that it was there was a some slight similarity there to Ugly Betty? Yeah, there definitely is. I mean, Gloria's journey in, in Barbie is, is very much um, one of, of of a woman looking for permission to to express who she is, and also um, who is looking to be seen and to be acknowledged, and um, um, and I think that there are definitely you know similarities in the in the in the story of Ugly Betty. And your character gets, uh, I think, one of the. It's a surprisingly emotional film. But I think your character gets one of those moments where you deliver this really empowering a really powerful speech about what it is to be a woman. What was that like for you on that day on set when you got to do that? Yeah, we shot it over two days. They were two pretty intense days. Um, I was, you know, really excited to shoot that monologue. I'd been talking with Greta about it for, for months and we'd spent months, you know, tweaking it and, and talking about it. So there was a lot of energy built up to, to do it. But it's also, you know, it, it, it feels like a turning point in the story a turning point for for all the characters um so i was i was really excited to get it a, a, excited to to get it right <laughs> um and you know there's a little bit of you know uh responsibility in it but um i really enjoyed shooting it <laughs>